Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Natalie with Natalie's Closet and today we are doing Small Online Business Wednesday where I will be featuring Ginger Snap That and Little Lady Crochet. So I'll be back in a sec. So welcome back everyone. As I said, this is Natalie with Natalie's Closet and I am going to be featuring Ginger Snap That and Little Lady Crochets. Um, I'm also going to be opening, I'm going to show you day 19 of my Halloween advent from Fangirl Fibers and we'll be opening day 20 with you and depending on how much time we have left over, I may open um, a box from David's Tea because I really want to get into it, even though it's all like one tea, but there's a cup in there I really want to get to. Um, and I don't want to wait until Sunday for getting to know you. Uh, so we're going to play it by ear because I don't know why I just keep not having space on my camera, even though I keep deleting videos and it says I have space on my camera. So um, anyway, let's get started with Ginger Snap That. Well, actually, before we get started, first, I would like to welcome all of our new subscribers. Welcome back, everyone else. Thank you all so incredibly much for your support. If you are new, I would love it if you'd consider hitting the red subscribe button down below as well as the notification bell next to that. Make sure you set it to all so that you're notified anytime I upload a video. And if you guys wouldn't mind um, giving this video a th <laughs> I'm norm I normally don't have my pen in my hand. If you wouldn't mind giving this video a thumbs up as well as commenting and sharing, I would greatly appreciate it. It really does help me out as well as watching the video from start to finish. Also, I wanted to remind you that I did announce on Monday uh, my Halloween giveaway. So make sure to check that video out. I'll put it up in the cards um, and enter if you haven't done so yet. Make sure you watch until the end um, so that you know what question to ask. Well, I mean, just it would be nice if you would watch it from start to finish, but make sure you watch until you see what it is that you need to answer to be able to enter the giveaway. Um, oh, hold on one second. I forgot something. I'll be right back. Okay, so welcome back. Um, I forgot to turn down the TV, so I wanted to go ahead and do that. Although typically you guys don't even notice it until I mention. I'm sorry about the TV. But, um, and I am warm because I was just outside recording <laughs> a video. I need to do this. I need to do it opposite. I need to record inside first, then go outside. Um, and I was in the sun, like the sun was beating down on me while I was recording. So... Yeah, and when I went to go pick up my black water bottle that is an insulated one, I put it against my arm. I can still see, I mean, I don't have a, it, it didn't blister, but holy cow, was it hot. I mean, I literally almost dropped it, my phone, everything. I, it took me off guard, but anyway, enough about that. So hopefully I will cool off here in a little bit. I'm just checking my scape to make sure that I didn't forget to like not move something or whatever. But anyway, so let's get to Ginger Snap That. Uh, Kim is the shop owner. Uh, they are based out of Canada. Uh, they ship within the Canada and US. So I'm sorry for those of you that are live overseas. Um, I had reached out to them when I, when I, I've actually had this package for a while, like months and months. Um, but I had reached out to them because she, they were busy doing stuff and they said they would get back to me. Then I reached out and they, I think were on vacation or something. They were out of town. And then, um, she was going to read the email that I had sent to them. And, um, I had, I never ended up reaching back out but I had several other things that came up that needed to be shown. So I mentioned that I was going to, you know, it'll be a while. So just get back to me. The customer service is fine. She was able to respond. It's just, I think we've been on like different wavelengths as far as when I was trying, you know, just different things. So I have had this for a while. Um, but she does have a bunch of, a bunch of cool stuff in her shop. She's got small, medium and large project bags. Um, from what I could tell, there was lace weight, fingering, DK and worsted weight yarns. Um, they also have sock blanks. Um, from what I could tell, I didn't go into every listing, but from what I can tell, as far as the fiber bases, they've got like 75 superwash merino, 25% nylon. 
um, 100% superwash merino, I believe was in the DK that I saw. And then they've also got mohair, um, which is the lace weight. And then she, they've got hat, mitten, and sweater kits. Um, also, they've got pins, notions, and progress keepers on their Etsy shop. I will put the link in the description box below. I do not have a coupon code for them, um, but for this video, I will put I'll put um, the link you know closer to the top so that you have easy access to it. Oops, I forgot my scissors. Since I'm standing, I don't have everything set up like I normally would. So yeah, please bear with me. Um, anyway, so it came in this package. Um, I've, they sent it out July 14th. I can't remember when I received it. I think it took about two weeks. I think I got it like this, maybe the end of the first week of August, um, possibly middle, uh, mid August. I can't remember, but I've had this for a while now. I feel like there are two things in here. However, I can't remember, maybe they sent, I don't know if they sent something for um, a future surprise giveaway because they didn't mention anything about it, or if this was what I'm expecting. So I'm going to open it without you guys. And then if I realize, oh, no, okay. So this is just, I got this, all right. I even looked at what the I, I even looked at it at what it was so that I could remember and I don't remember I didn't remember it being this so this is awesome all right so I'll just go ahead and share it with you look at that oh my goodness it matches my shirt like perfectly oh I love this this is absolutely stunning I will take it out of the bag um, there is their logo which is on the yarn band also this is so yeah! Oh, I love these colors. This is so exciting. It's really, it's hurting my back to stand. So bear with me. Um, where's the opening? Oh, maybe it's underneath this sticker. Is that where it is? Hold on, bear with me. Yep, okay. So I just ripped their sticker and I like keeping stickers intact, but oh well. Okay. I love it. I love it. I love it. Ginger Snap. And for Instagram, it's Ginger Snap That One. I'll, incl I'll include that in um, the description box below also. Um, it's hand dyed in Calgary, Canada. Uh, this is called Pink Lemonade Frenzy Full Set. Um, it's puffy fingering, which is an 80% superwash merino, 20% nylon. The kit total is 473 yards and it's 135 grams. It says care instructions, hand wash in cool water, lay flat to dry, hand dyed yarn may bleed, prolonged soaking may cause bleeding. So, so the whole kit is 473 yards. That's interesting because typically 100 grams is about 460, 470 I guess it could be as low as 400 and then minis typically add about another 80, 90 yards. Um, so I'm guessing that the two, because I'm, these are probably 50 gram Hanks, these two, um, larger ones. So I'm guessing that's probably about 500, I'm sorry, 400 yards. And then the mini is probably the 35 grams, although minis are typically 20 grams. I don't know. I'm not even going to try to figure it out, but the total, um, total length is 473 yards, but look, oh, I have something standing right here. Look at the colors of this. Is this not beautiful? Oh, I love it. I love it. It almost looks like it could be, I don't know if it's self-striping. I don't know that it is, but this is stunning. I love the colors and this pink is wow. Wow, wow, wow. And it's pretty, it's pretty right there. I mean, it, it's pretty true on colors. OMG, I love it. I know I'm not looking at you guys. I'm looking at the yarn and, and the, yeah, okay. So <laughs> anyway, this is awesome. I absolutely love it. Love it, love it. So there's, if you want to see the back of the yarn band, um, this is so cool, gorgeous, Kim. And I really do love their logo. It's awesome. So Ginger Snap That. Well, this just says Ginger Snap, but it is Ginger Snap That 
one on Instagram and the Etsy shop is etsy.com. So, okay, I'll put the link in the description box below. But I love it. It is awesome. It matches my top, like almost straight on. Awesome. Yay! I love it. Okay, so ginger snap that. Now I'm going to um, open an envelope from Little Lady Crochets. Now, Lady, Little Lady Crochets is out of California. Um, I will put the link to her. I believe she's still on Etsy versus on, what was she on before? She moved, She had moved her shop. I think she moved it back to Etsy. But I will put the link to her shop in the description box below. She is the one who, who wrote the patterns for the boob and the booty pillow um, that I have shared with you guys in the past that I've started making. Um, and she also makes the penis pillows, but she uses the pattern that I, I got that I use from another creator. Um, but she, on her Etsy shop, she's got the pattern, she's got patterns to, um, the boob, the booty pillow. Plus she's got some toys, like adult toy patterns. Um, and she also sells her stickers, which she's got a bunch of stickers, which is what is in this envelope. Um, she doesn't, or she will, she does sell her finished pillows. However, she only opens them up. Like I think, I think she's only opened them up so far. I want to say twice this year, maybe three times. I think it was like January, um, maybe March or April. And then again in like August ish. Um, and I think she like opens it up and has like maybe 50 or 60, it could be even more than that. But I think this last time she limited it a little bit more, but then she takes a few months to make them. She sends them out. She opens it up, you know, that type of a thing. But, um, so she does sell her finished pillows, but it's only, you would have to follow her on Instagram so that you can get notified when she is going to be opening up you know, her shop for the pillows. Otherwise it's the patterns for the boob and the booty pillow and then the adult toy pillows. So let's go ahead. I got some, um, I got some of her stickers and I want to go ahead and share that. Uh, she is a small business, uh, totally. And, um, I, uh, she was going to set up a coupon code for us but she is so ridiculously busy. I mean, she's like, she's definitely an influencer on Instagram as well as, well, TikTok, she keeps having issues with the adult things and then her stuff getting, um, like taken down. But, um, she is definitely, I mean, she has a large following and she is very busy. She almost literally works like morning to night every day making these pillows. Uh, but as soon as I'm able to remind her about the coupon code, I will. And then if, when I'm able to get it, I'll include it in the description box. And I'll let you guys know when it is and that it's in the description box. I was just making sure that she didn't write it down here, but she didn't. Um, but she's out of Sacramento, California. And let's go ahead and check it out. So she's got them in this, uh, foil sleeve let's go ahead and open them she's got all, a ton of different stickers a ton of different stickers but I wanted to be able to feature her as a small business because she is a small business and even though she has no problems um getting orders for her pillows she's still a small business and I just wanted to support her in some way outside of just her patterns um so this is her business card and that's her main sticker that she's got also, but that is her, um, logo. And here is her information, a little laughter in every package. Um, if you want to take a screenshot, that's got her Instagram account, which I'll include down below as well as her website and her Etsy shop. Now here are the stickers. I honestly, I can't remember if she, she may have included extras in here. Um, but I don't know. This one says Little Lady Crochet, and it's her holding her um, penis pillows. Oh, I'm sorry. I should tell you to look away. I mean, it's not graphic, I don't think. But if you want, I apologize. If you want to look away for these couple of stickers, I'll let you know when I'm done. But um, so that's that one. And then this one just says boobs, and it's got her boob pillow. And then she's got this one that says, kiss my beep. 
and it's got the booty pillow on there. Of course, I had to get it in the blue because blue is my favorite color. Then this one just says Little Lady Crochet and it or crochets and it's the penis pillow. And then this one says you are bootyful. <laughs> booty because it's a booty pillow. So you are bootyful. And it also says Little Lady Crochets on there. So I did, like I said, I did want to go ahead and feature as a small business because she is a small business. I am, you know, I, I have been able to reach out to her a few times. And, um, of course, I am using her um, booty and boob pillows. Or the badonk. Oh, I just bit the inside of my mouth. The badonkadonk um, pattern. That's the booty pillow. So those are the two shops. I hope you, you know, if you're interested, check both of them out. Remember, let me know what your favorite is in this video, whether it's one of the stickers or the yarn I showed you, if it's something on their sites, if it's everything, if it's nothing, if it's whatever the case is. Let me know what is your favorite because that is an automatic entry into a future surprise giveaway. Um, now let's go ahead. Hi. I'm going to go ahead and show you day 19 of the advent calendar. The Halloween advent. I love it. I showed it on my live last night because it was the 19th. Uh, but look at that. Is that not beautiful? I love the neon that's in the green and of course the speckling. This is probably one of my favorite favorites that I've op opened so far, but it is so pretty. So, so pretty. So that was day 19 and now we'll open day 20 together. So let's go ahead and open I'm not looking. Day 20 together. Ooh, more greens. Oh, this is fun. Look, there's more neon in there. I love it. I love it, love it. So this is definitely very pretty. Um, and there is speckling in there. So you all know that's one of my favorite techniques. This is very, very pretty. I still like that other one and I, there was another there were another couple that I really 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 liked I love them all but there are a few that were my absolute favorites um, so that is it for the small businesses and the advent uh, advent bags now I'm gonna go ahead and open ow, oh my back my David's tea box yay to build a relationship with them but I'm gonna go ahead oopsie well that's my PO box anyway I don't care so I'm gonna go ahead and open this awesome David's tea box I'm still expecting one from them that's supposed to have some goodies they are sending me uh oh hold on I gotta put it down for a second all right I picked it back up though this kind of sucks not having the tabletop So I got the Halloween tin. Oh, there's, there should be four Halloween. Yeah, there are four Halloween tins because I got uh, at least 16. Yeah, at least 16 ounces of tea. So for every four ounces, you get a free tin. So it says David's tea on it. And these are the Halloween ones. So I have four identical ones like this. And I went ahead and I got, let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. I got 11 two-ounce bags of my absolute, well, it's not my absolute favorite tea from them. My absolute favorite tea from them was Luscious Watermelon. They no longer make it. Then I loved Cherry Lacuma. That was my next favorite. Cherry Berry Punch, after they retired Cherry Lacuma, is my next favorite but um they are going to be retiring this so i'm getting as much of it as i can so this is the cherry berry punch ow let's see it's got black tea apple hibiscus blossoms candy pineapple natural flavoring raspberries and stevia extract and it's a product of germany so Love it, love it, love it. If you have a chance to go on to their site uh, and you like fruity flavored teas, especially cherry, I would definitely recommend this one. Um, 
Last time I checked, it was like $3 and something. Now, I can't guarantee they're going to still have it. If they have it, I will put the link in the description box below so you can check it out and go there directly. Now, let me get my mug. Now, this one was also on clearance, and I think it's because it's probably a spring-summer one. But... This is the watermelon tumbler and it is an insulated um, cup and I don't know if you can see I didn't even notice it almost looks like it's crackled like you know like crackled glass kind of sort of and it's got the green top so it's watermelon colored and I'm all about the watermelon any time of year so um, it's an insulated uh, cup I have so many of their cups. I've got their color changing ones. I've got like three or four of those. I've got my Halloween holographic one, which is sitting on my countertop right there. I had that on my live last night. I've got this one. I've got a couple other ones um, that I can steep tea in, but it keeps the tea on the bottom and kind of stops it from steeping after it's done at the time it's supposed to. And then this is really Sorry, it, uh, this is the straw which has like a stopper on it and a matching um, straw brush. So yeah, I'm so excited I have my watermelon cup now. Um, and it's got like a rubber bottom on it so that it can, it, it doesn't slide, which is awesome. Oh crap, hold on a second, my glasses just fell off. Jeez. All right, so that's it for today. Uh, relatively short video. Um, I just wanted to get all this stuff out there. I hope you have a wonderful day. I would love it if you're still here to check out my new channel, which is Empty Your Closet for Miley. Um, it is an awareness video on supporting um, local and or my um, animal shelters and or rescues. So Miley would also appreciate it. Oh crap, hold on one second, I'll be right back. Sorry about that. Um, but Miley would love it if her peeps would go and support her on that channel. It's all on behalf of her um, and two different organizations that I am going to be um, helping support, whether in fundraising, um, if you guys have things that you would like to send me to donate, if you don't have local shelters or, or rescues near you, or you just don't have the time to take the stuff, but you would be willing to send it to me. Or if you send monetary donations to the Cash App account that I have set up for it, I will, I will be as transparent as possible and show, I'll do the video showing me dropping off everything that has been given to me. Uh, but just go ahead and check that out. Link is in the description box below, as well as our other two channels. Uh, so all of that's there if you want to go check it out. So I hope you guys have a great day. I will see you on Getting to Know You, which will be likely not until Sunday, as per usual lately. Um, and otherwise, I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your week. Uh, thank you all so incredibly much for the prayers for us, as well as for Sherry and the positive thoughts, and for everybody else that I've always requested for. Um, thank you so much for that. I thought there was something else I wanted to tell you guys, but I can't remember what it is. So, oh well, uh, if I remember, I'll write it down for uh, getting to know you. But um, I hope you have a great time setting up for Halloween. Of course, I celebrate all month long with my scape because I absolutely love Halloween, except I forgot to get my nails done, which goes to show you how off my brain has been because I don't think I've not done Halloween nails in years. But anyway... Um, remember for every season, there's reason to crochet. My mom did say to say hello and yeah, uh, love hugs and prayers to everybody. Extra prayers for those who need it. If you need extra prayers or positive thoughts and you don't want to share it publicly, email me at natalies.closet at yahoo.com. We will add you to our prayers. And if you would rather I not include it into a prayer list on camera, even anonymously, um, please let me know and we'll just keep private prayers for you uh, and and if you're still here and I keep forgetting to mention it in the beginnings of the videos 
um, and you would like to get a Christmas card and you don't think I have your address, email me your address. I'll put it into my handy dandy address, address book and you will get a Christmas card from me this year. And if you happen to mention your birthday month, you could very well also get a birthday card. Um, so have a wonderful day and week and I will see you guys in the next Getting to Know You. And don't forget to go ahead and enter the Halloween giveaway if you haven't done so on Monday's video and make sure to watch until you know what you have to answer in order to enter. So I will talk to you guys soon. Love you guys. Have a great day. Bye.